In this video, we're going to talk about how to multiply mixed numbers using cross cancellation. So we have 2 and 3 6 and we want to multiply by 4 and 2 7 So what we need to do is convert each mixed number to an improper fraction. So first, let's begin by rewriting the denominator. Next, we'll multiply the whole number by the denominator and then add the numerator. 2 times 6 is 12 plus 3, that's 15. Now let's do the same thing for the second fraction. Let's rewrite the denominator, the 7. Next, 4 times 7 is 28 plus 2, that's 30. Now, since we're dealing with some relatively large numbers, we want to cancel before we multiply. 15, we can write that as 5 times 3. 6, we can write that as 3 times 2. 7, I'm just going to leave that as 7 times 1. 30, we can write that as 2 times 15. Notice that we could cancel a 3, and we could cancel a 2, and that's about it. So what we have left over is 5 times 15. Now we can multiply across. 5 times 15 is 75. 7 times 1 is 7. Now, this is our answer. But typically, since the problem was written as mixed numbers, you want to convert this improper fraction back to a mixed number. So you could use long division, or you could do it this way. The highest multiple of 7 under 75 is 70. And 75 minus 70 is 5. So we could break apart this fraction into these two smaller fractions. Now, 70 divided by 7 is 10. So we have 10 plus 5 over 7. Whenever you have a whole number and a fraction, you could write it as a mixed number. So we could write that as 10 and 5 sevenths. So that's the answer. That's how you can multiply two mixed numbers using cancellation.